Hey guys, how you doing? I'm Nyx. I recently rewatched the X-Men Cinematic Universe because I kind of felt like I betrayed them after becoming so obsessed with MCU's Avengers. Unlike MCU films, I'm quite more familiar with the X-Men movies before and I really like to become a mutant. It just seems more realistic and easy to understand because of the DNA alterations to become one. I started with the page of the movie posters which I arranged in chronological order. I realized that I haven't really watched their older films like the X-Men trilogy. I only watched those with the new cast starring James McAvoy, Michael Fassbender, Jennifer Lawrence, and so on. The thing after I watch all their movies is I got more confused instead of fully understanding and be amazed to how well it is stitched together just like in Marvel Cinematic Universe of Avengers. I don't know, I just really don't understand the timeline well even after so I research, read some articles, watch some videos explaining the whole timeline. What makes the whole timeline confusing is obviously the fact that the first movies released are in 2000 started with the old versions of the characters making it difficult to introduce the backstory of the characters but made possible in Days of Future Past wherein they relaunch a new timeline after Logan time travel to fix the events and disregarding what happened in X-Men Origins and The Last Stand. At this point, I don't really suggest to watch all the X-Men films in chronological order just like what I did. I honestly enjoyed the movies more when I first watched them. They are way more satisfying as standalone films for me. I just kinda expected that it will give me the same amazement I had with Avengers but it obviously didn't. Anyway, I made a page for each films too. My favorites are First Class, Apocalypse, Dark Phoenix, The Wolverine, Deadpool 2, and Logan. So half of them actually. And apparently, those films featuring the new and younger cast members. Lastly, I made a page for my favorite mutants. I can't really choose a specific one and I can't rank them too because I have different reasons for liking them. My first favorite is Raven because it is played by Jennifer Lawrence and her character is likable and also relatable because of her insecurities and how she overcomes it. Next one is Charles because I like his superpowers. And then Magneto or Eric who is the kind of villain that I could never hate for some reason. Other X-Men that I like are because of their cool superpowers like Storm, Quicksilver, and Rogue. I also prefer their characters when they were much younger, especially Jean Grey played by Sophie Turner. It's just because I'm not a fan of her involvement with Logan as they grew old. And then the only characters I like with their old versions were Storm played by Halle Berry and Cyclops played by James Marsden. Most importantly, I like Wolverine as well because among all X-Men, he has the most consistent plot and he's played by the one and only actor you Jackman.
that's all for this video. My movie and TV journal volume 3 is officially done. So if you want to see a flip through of this whole journal, subscribe and turn on the notification bell because I'll be uploading that next after this. See you soon. Bye.